Hey guys, and welcome back to Medal of Honor. When we last left off, we were going undercover. And I don't know if my microphone is positioned correctly. Uh, if you'd guessed it was to do with the cats, you'd be right. There we go, I think that's better. Um, yeah, so anyway, let's continue with that. Next couple of missions coming up are quite fun. Find the gift package. Oh yeah, we were still on this, weren't we? I remember, I had to go to the shop. Uh, so I've kind of done a load of stuff and forgot what we were doing. Um, now that you've survived the initial field test of your basic uh, conversational German, it's time to get down to the business. First, you'll... F First, you'll find stuck to the wall a clipboard holding a freight manifest. Steal it. Shush. Steal it. It contains a roster of all German metal works. Metal works? That's kind of weird. Um, is that like a German spelling? I don't know. I don't think so. The manufactured parts for Greta. The 8th Air Force is very interested in drawing up a new target list based on its contents. <laughs> Second, you'll need to locate a special gift package that's been left for you by an undercover Marquis agent. It contains a sniper rifle, some ammunition, and more. most importantly, the custom demolition charges that are needed to destroy Greta. Finally, we want you to blow up Greta's reserve engine. She's a specially armoured beast that has escaped several strafing runs relatively unscathed. It's a good target of opportunity for you. To place a demolition charge, look for a throbbing red box. <laughs> throbbing red box. I'm 32. It's not that funny. <laughs> This indicates a location suitable for explosives. Place the action button to set the charge. Uh, as for the gift package, I'm not sure where it is or what it looks like. All I know is that the marquee agent who left it for you travels undercover as a member of the Reich Marshal Goner Right on Reich Marshal. Gonering's official orchestra. Hmm, okay. Oh, also, remember I said I was bidding on uh, Medal of Honor Underground. <laughs> oh, God, that was way more awkward than I thought it would be. Ta da! It arrived. So, I, for one, am quite chuffed with that. Very good condition as well. Very good condition. Excellent. If you were wondering if we was going to LP it, you'd be right. <sighs> and what's going on with my PlayStation? Um, PlayStation? Uh, PlayStation. Well, this is the trouble of using real hardware, I suppose. One second, guys. And we're back, guys. I don't know. I think I just need to reset the PlayStation. That seems to have uh, solved everything. Excellent. Right. Well, looks like we're on another sneak sneak mission. Well, the manifest we need is right here. <laughs> Excellent. So, let's go about acquiring our materials. Hey, buddy. You all right? Good, 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 good. Gee, I hope nobody comes along and horribly murders you. All right. Well, let's open this door. Interesting. This door continuously makes the door opening sound. I actually found that on uh, someone else's YouTube video that I randomly stumbled across a couple of days ago. Hello. Hello. Skeleton something. He's also uh, done an LP of this. Uh, a very, very good one, I might add. Okay. He's, he's a small channel. We've got about 1,100 uh, subscribers. Um, but yeah. Very good stuff. Right. Let's go. Now the chief. Evening. Forgive me, sir. You are forgiven. You're soon to be dead. Right. Rifle rounds. Excellent. So we've got a sniper rifle and some charges. Lovely. Right, let's get our little friend out. Mr. Head Popper. Boop. <laughs> I saw nothing. I certainly didn't murder anybody. What are you talking about? Oh, hello. Let's see our little friend here. You right there, Fritzel? Boom! Careful where you look, sir. We can go around like murder everyone now. 
kind of got what we want. This level is like way easier than um, the last one. Now, you watch me horribly burk this level up, like big time. I wish we had some kind of like melee attack, but I guess we don't really need one. Boop. Now that guy's a dick. It doesn't matter what papers you show him. He won't believe you. He'd be like, oh, you're Jimmy Patterson, and start blasting your ass out of your, uh, out of your head. That is a skill, uh, to shoot someone's ass out of their head. But these Germans can do it, if given the time. You won't be careful, these guys. Because if you alert them, they will go and push the alarm. Which is not nice of the dickheads, to be honest. Although it doesn't matter too much. We should more or less be equipped to handle anything that comes our way. Uncle Fritz doesn't know who he's dealing with. Yeah, there, buddy. There you are. What do you think of that? Oh, he doesn't care. He's just saluting us. Right, well, I suppose we could use our information. Forgive me, sir. You are forgiven. I don't know what you're forgiven for, but uh, you are forgiven. Don't worry, anyway, my friend. All your sins will be forgiven very, very soon. Right, let's get rid of that car. Move before we are horribly murdered. Ah, that was not good, guys. <laughs> I got stuck. I literally could not escape. Well, no matter. Whoa. Hey! I've never seen someone here before. What the hell was that about? Okay. Not sure what was going on there. I've never seen a Nazi in here before. Well, hopefully we should be okay. There's plenty of health on this level. Oh, hey, friend. Right, he's dead. Now, although it looks like we can shoot through this, we cannot. This is bulletproof. God damn it. These Germans know how to make some good chicken wire. Come on, Fritzel. There we go. Oh, God. Yeah, remember when I said there's plenty of health? Might have just burgered it up. Seems to have been more Germans here than usual. And... There's supposed to be a health canteen there. But there isn't. Okay, weird things are happening here, guys. There was a German here that shouldn't have been there. And we're missing health. Hmm. Okay, well, we should be able to pull it off, nonetheless. Okay. Um... Well, let's continue for now. I think, yeah, I think there should be enough health. As long as we don't take too much more damage, we should be fine. There was like another canteen up here, I think. Oh, yeah. See this officer. This officer's turned up. I don't know what he's doing, just standing there like a moron. He's like, oh, hi. I'm here to evaluate the performance. He turns up. He's like, oh, everybody's dead. I guess I'll just stand here like a moron. Understandable. Ah, bollocks. There's no help here either. Well, 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 well. There is some help behind here. We might have burgered this up, you know. Yeah, shit. Why was that help not there? Hmm. I'm genuinely curious. There should have been a medical canteen there. Because usually I lean on that one quite a bit. Um, right, well... We may be burgered here if we don't find any more health. We took way too much damage. There's usually not that many enemies there. Which is a little bit frustrating. God damn it. Why does nothing go to plan? Jimmy, what have you done? You burgered the whole thing up. You moron. You took too many bullets to the face. <laughs> what have I told you about taking bullets to the face? Don't do it. Right, well, we've got a Jerry here. But he's uh, of no import to us. Alright, let's keep going down. Now, you want to be careful here. 
I don't know. Ah, there he is. There is a guy that spawns behind you. And he is a bit of a dick if you're not expecting him. Okay, come on. There's two enemies left on this map. And I'm hoping, beyond all hope, there's one, that there's also some health here. However, I, yeah, there is. Okay, ooh, 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 ooh. We should, we should be on 75% health. I'm not sure how this game like calculates it. Triumph, keep it up, soldier. Oh, man. Cross your fingers, guys, and your toes. We may just have survived that one. Yes, we did. Nice. We got lucky there. Um, so, yeah, that's so strange to see some health literally missing. Uh, I don't know what to say about that one. Oh, well. All right, let's drop down a save anyway. Now, you get like 4 to 5%. Um, for each five star ranking you get. Uh, not really sure how the percentage is calculated because it's a bit weird. Uh, we're on 16% on the LP, whereas on my, my test to save, should we say, I'm on 29%, which is weird. Huh, I'm not going to think about it too much. Right, let's drop down a save and continue. There's one more mission left of this level, and it's quite a fun one. Although, <laughs> uh, it can't go south. Okay. Yeah, wait, hang on. Is there one more left, or is there two more? Ooh, I'm not sure. Uh, no, there is two more, but one's tiny. Don't expect a friendly reception now the Germans... Uh, from the Germans in the canyon. They've by now heard about what you did back at the station, so make yourself less of a target and lose the officer's uniform. You'll need to rely on stealth now instead of substifu uh, subterfuge. Uh, the newly acquired Springfield sniper rifle should come in, uh, should become your new best friend. Uh, yeah, it's all right, but it doesn't do a lot of damage, um, and it's very, very, very slow. But it's not bad. The Germans have fortified this section of track into a gauntlet of machine gun emplacements, so be extremely careful. Fortunately, there's more than one way into these bunkers. The soldiers in the area are members of the Greta support crew, so they're tired and bored, most likely not watching the back door. Head towards the ominous flashes on the horizon. That's not lightning. Lightning. That's Greta. Be sure to procure some new weapons like an MP40 submachine gun and even more importantly, some steel hand grenade stick grenades. Steel hand grenada. Something like that. Stick grenades. Uh, the ones you Americans call potato mashers. Use them to blow up a fuel depot that we spotted on the recon photo. Also, be on the lookout for a supply camp that's probably contains some useful items to uh, liberate. Yeah, that supply camp uh, is totally optional, but absolutely worth going to. Well, we have to go there because we have to kill everybody. But you can if you don't know where it is, you can totally miss it out. The fight continues. That it does. And I love that scene. That looks so cool. Might be a slightly longer video. Maybe. Okay. Right, let's get going. Yeah, bridges. And the atmosphere on this level is freaking great. I think a lot of the atmosphere in this game has to do with the music. The excellent music, I might add. You've got to watch these bridges, because it can be quite hard to kill the Germans that are hiding up there. Yeah, we could go dead ahead, but let's take this path. Medkit there, we'll have to remember him. Alright, let's sneak, sneak, sneak. Sneak, sneak, sneak. Sneak, sneak, sneak. I'm sneaking up on you, Jerry. I'm going to put a bullet in the back of your head. Because that's what we do around here. Hey, buddy. Boop. Boop. Oh, man. Pathetic. Alright, let's go knock this bunker out. Alright, let's stand up, grab the gun, and make it sing! Eat my lead, you bastards. Oh, I thought he was dead then. 
Yeah, you get quite a lot of protection in these bunkers, but you're not invincible, as you can plainly see. Now, if we destroy these... There we go. We can actually blow the doors off, which is quite nice. <coughs> right, we'll have to remember that there is uh, health here, if we need it. And we probably will need it. Ooh. Let's take this path. Always take these paths if you can. Especially if you're going for the max um, rank. See that Jerry just like laying there. Well, there's the fuel containers destroyed. That wasn't exactly a challenge, was it? No matter. Now, because we destroyed the fuel containers, Jerry's going to have a bit of a warm welcome for us. We have Hans and Fritz just down here. Hey, guys. I'm sure there are other German names as well. Like Uda and Gunther. But we know Hans and Fritz. Hmm, looks like we've got another machine gun turret up ahead. Alright, well, when that happens, we take this way. Ooh, hello. What's this way as well? Hmm. Oh, yeah, this is what I was saying. This is very, very easy to miss. This is the supply depot. So, let's see what's going on around here. Ah, hey, buddy. I wouldn't be just sitting down having a smoke if I was you. Although, I suppose it's a little bit more realistic on this level. They can't hear us because of Greta singing her delightful tune. Ooh. Yeah, you can, you can see the rifle. I personally think the rifle should be a one-hit kill. But it is not. Even if you get a headshot with it. Hey, buddy. Man. Okay, hopefully he threw that grenade at himself. No, he didn't. This Jerry is smarter than I gave him credit for. I'm going to save a couple of these nades. Oh, man. Alright, let's go kill him. Because of that kind of... You know, thinking about it like that. That means, like, the rifle... Oh, God. The rifle ain't much more powerful than the pistol. I guess the helmet protects him from one bullet. But still. Alright, he's dead. Alright, I've got a med kit there. Which is nice. We're gonna... Maybe pill for that later. But we've also got a canteen by the fire, which makes sense. And look at all these goodies. Another med kit and tons of ammo. Tons of delicious, delicious ammo. But look up there. Sneaky, sneaky. This guy does creep in once we raid the supplies. Hey, buddy. What, uh, what you doing? Boom! No more bratwurst for you, pal. Okay, whoa, I don't know what kind of animation he was going for, but I think he was just trying to be dramatic, you know. You know how the Germans are. <laughs> Gotta be dramatic in all things. Uh, med kit down there as well. So that's like 50% health, well, over 50% health that we can now potentially heal. Because we've got the two med kits. Uh, yeah, let's go down here as well. Alright, let's go sneak into this bunker. See if we can catch hands with his pants down. Hey, buddy. What, uh, what you doing? Oh, God. You can see the inaccuracies there of this weapon. No matter. Oh, God. Definitely should have used the pistol here, I think. Uh-oh. Nope, we don't want that. There we go. Pistol would definitely have been the best choice there. I completely burgered that up by my own my own reasons. Uh, oh, although, there is a canteen there. This is nice. Hey, pal! Nice night to be riddled full of holes. Swiss cheese. Alright, let's grab that. Is there another guy out there? I thought there was. Nope. Alright, well, we're back up to max health anyway. Ooh. Uh, get the SMG back out. 
Now, I love the SMG, but it does go through ammo at quite the rate, which is unfortunate. Ooh. Ah, shit. Forgot about these guys. Yeah, these guys can be quite hard to get because sometimes they hide over that rock there. When they do that, the only chance you have of being able to hit them is with a nade. Ooh, hey Fritz. Didn't see you there, hiding in the dark. Oh, I've got the cure for what ails you. Come on. Yeah, I, I think the rifle should be a one-hit kill in the head. Absolutely it should. But unfortunately, ooh, hello. Because they chose to uh, have that rather cool for the PlayStation um, helmet animation, kind of makes it a little bit silly. Alright, well, let's keep going. There is another bunker here. This bunker's a bastard. Because if you can get behind it, I don't know how. But. Yeah, that's cured his problem anyway. That gun will kill you literally in seconds. So we don't really want anything to do with that. Right, let's open the door. Knock, knock, motherfucker. Although there's no one in here. Uh, not sure. Oh, yeah. I was going to say, I wasn't sure. Damn it. If anyone spawns. Though we couldn't quite turn the gun enough, which was a little bit annoying. Come on. There we go. Good enough. Yeah, those guys were behind the arc of the gun, which was a little bit annoying, but no matter. We overcome all obstacles in this man's army. Uh, we can't actually drop down, I don't think, over that way. But that's fine. Uh, yeah, sure. Why not? I suppose. Oh, okay. So that's all that there is there. There's like another way into that gun turret, but I don't think you can really sneak around there, so there's no point. Now, we can still go all the way back if we need health. Uh, on top of one of these is health as well. Let's go clear this place out. Um, uh oh. Don't look this. Oh, you knobhead. What a dick. Alright, we don't want to go this way, because uh, Uncle Uncle Gunther has set up a nice little trap for us. So, we're having none of that. Oh, hey. Didn't see you in there, friend. Have a potato masher. Although, I don't think that did an awful lot of anything. Son of a bitch. Oh, there goes his helmet. <laughs> Let's see that big egg of yours. I don't know. Oh, we got it. Okay, I think we like fired through the rock. Somehow. Right, cool. Um, right, we can't really progress forward here. Although maybe we can. Yeah, there we go. There's the machine gun. And that decimates us, as you can see. Um, I, I actually thought there were some guys down there. Actually, I know there is. Alright, well, there's still plenty of health on this level, so we're not hosed yet. You right there, but hey, you were shooting me without actually being able to see me. You sneaky bastard. Sadly, the SMG ain't much use at this range, but we made it happen. We reached out and touched him. Oh god, here they come, like rats scurrying out. Of the sinking ship. That's fine. Oh, medkit there. Didn't even know that was there. Nice. And medical canteen. Very, very, very nice. Oh, God. I forgot about these guys. You can see the actual aiming reticle is a little bit off. Seriously, guys. Can you just, like, die for me? I'm not asking for anything extravagant here. I just want you to fall down and bleed to death. That's it. It's not a lot to ask. 
haven't it? We better than what some of the other allies would do to you. Just be thankful I don't have a flamethrower. I don't think you get a flamethrower in this game. In fact, I know you don't. You do later on in the series, but not in this game. Um, right, let's go. I think the flamethrower would have been quite hard for the... Um, would have been quite hard for the PlayStation to render in this kind of style. I think there's another medcat. Medcat? Medcat? Yeah, there's another medcat. There's another medkit up here. But we don't need it. Cool. And we've still got like two medkits all the way back at the beginning of the level if we need them. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right. Down here there's a few. Now we can actually get down to the rifle to the gun below us, but it's quite risky because there's so many enemies down here. Right, we don't want to go that way because that will end the level. Right, give me the gun. Give me the gun. There we go. That actually worked. I've never managed to jump on this gun like that before because usually you just get cream. But I'm happy with that performance. Alright, nice. And we have completed the mission. Let's go. Only 38 enemy kills. Concerned about that. I thought there was more enemies here. No matter. Yeah, we still got it. We still got it. 38 kills. Rank 3. Three for three. Nice. Right, uh, what are we on? We're on 23 minutes. Actually, we should be good. This next bit is very, very, very short. Very fun. Very hectic, but very short. This one can go bad. But because it's such a short level, it doesn't matter. It's not like the end of the world if we have to replay it. <clears throat> okay, saving. Do not remove memory card. Well, I hadn't planned on it, game. Um, right, let's continue. Let's take this one home, guys. I just got word that another ship in the channel was hit by one of Greta's massive shells. You've got to hurry, Patterson. Yes, boss. Remember to look for the throbbing red box. Boxes to place your demolition charges. You'll need to place four of them to disable Greta. They've been specified. Uh, specially wired for the synchronous detonation. As soon as the last one is attached, run for cover. Auf Wiedersehen, Greta. Yeah, you're damn right. These charges don't uh, have too much kick to them, so we don't have to run that far. Although I still can't believe in the previous level to the one that we just did, we actually got hit by that. <sighs> Come on. I couldn't manage to jump out of the way. Got glitched. No matter. Right, let's go. Now, there isn't a ton of health on this level. But there isn't a ton of enemies either. But we do have to be a little bit careful. This level was only a few minutes long. Right, let's be sneaky. There's enough to heal 50% health, I think. Unless we get lucky and an enemy drops a canteen. Which I don't think we can get lucky. Yeah, hey pal. Boop. Boop. Die, dude. Seriously, three bullets to the brain? Must have been a retard. Is that offensive to call people retards? I'm not sure. I know it started off as an actual medical term, but I think it became an insult or something. I'm not really sure. I don't really care, to be honest. Right, uh, ooh, yep, this bit can be nasty, because there is a lot of guys down here, including an officer. There he is. Hey, pal, have some bullets. Gee, your buddy, your buddy, your body is pretty good at filtering my bullets. Oh, 
These guys usually come running. I'm a little bit annoyed that they're not. There we go. Cool. Running out of rounds. There should be another guy down here. Or another two guys, actually. Yeah, there we go. Uh, suppose we can get the rifle out. Well, he disappeared. But I'm hoping he still brought the farm. Can you see me, buddy? I can see you. Whoa. Okay, the hitboxes are very generous, as you can see. Nice. Now, there's some health there, and that is the only health on this level. Admittedly, it's quite a significant amount, but that is it, ladies and gentlemen. Never mind. Right. We don't have many bullets either. We're going to have to make them count. We might have to get a little bit creative. But that's fine. This is the end of the level. There's Greta in all of her glory. But this place is full to the brim with enemies. But that's okay. Now, this actual handgun is a little bit more useful than the rifle. It's actually way more useful than you'd think. Although it's not super accurate or super powerful, like, this rate of fire makes up for it. Alright, let's go tag Greta. But before we kill Greta, we need to do another sweep to make sure all those jerrys are gone. Because a few more do spawn. Get out of here, Fritz. Hey, Gruber, where'd you run to? Should be another one. Ah, he's on the other side. Come on, Gruber. I got just what the doctor ordered for you. Surprise, motherfucker. Sit down and shut the fuck up. Right, now, when we blow this thing, the level's going to end. But we haven't taken a lot of hits, so it doesn't matter. So we can just, like demo this thing. They're not taking any chances with this, are they? This is quite cool. You can actually like watch it firing off. Um, it's kind of primitive, but it works. Also, look at the stars. There are some actual proper constellations there, which I thought was quite interesting. Quite surprised about that as well. Anyway, let's get rid of Greta before she shells any more ships. One for you, one for you. Not gonna be stingy now, we're gonna share them out. One for you, and one for you. And we're gonna stand back here and watch the fireworks. Boom! Now that's what you call a controlled explosion. Alf, we the same Greta indeed. Triumphant once again. <clears throat> Delivering explosive ordnance onto an enemy target has always been a major element of modern warfare. Artillery, tanks, and bombers evolved into lethal extensions of the mighty German war machine. Goering's Luftwaffe, working in tandem with the Wehrmacht's mighty siege guns, smashed across Europe, the Channel, and Britain herself. But tanks could be stopped, rail guns could be destroyed, and aeroplanes could be shot from the sky. Nice. I do like those. They're cool. So, we have medal awarded and secret code discovered. See list. Excelente. So, we only killed 19 enemies. I think there is only 19 enemies on that level. Uh, six objects we destroyed. Do we? Hmm. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Fair enough. 45% accuracy. We got Arm Slinger as well. Let's have a little look at our medals and save the game. Checking memory card. Browse answers. Browse answers. It's kind of like a weird way of select slot, but sure. Uh, right, Titan LP. Let's do it. Let's do it. Ugh. God damn it. Seriously, cats, like, this thing is 
the bane of my existence. There we go. Oh, looky dear. She looks so grumpy. <laughs> Am I disallowing you from getting in the way of the controls, Cloud? You little pain. Ah, right. Anyway, let's return to war room, I guess. Did I disturb you, your highness? Let's have a little look, shall we? War records. Um... Yeah, war records. I had to think there for a minute where they were. So, let's have a look at our performance first. So, we've only killed 208 enemies. Ha! Huh. Interesting. And overall, we are a winger. Fair play. And our medals. I think that's... Eight, there's nine medals to get in total because there is one that appears in the center I think we got the army commendation medal shame you can't actually look at those in detail and if we look at uh, the code we unlocked I can't remember what one we're going to get secret codes uh, we got American movie mode which changes the what the Germans shout into English. Now, I've never used this mode before. But I'm quite tempted to have it on. English. Deutsch. English. Deutsch. English. Deutsch. English. Deutsch. English. Deutsch. English. Deutsch. Um, hmm. Yeah, I might, might leave it on. English. Because I've never known like what the enemies shout at you. It could be quite interesting. Okay, anyway, we're going to go back. Right, anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. When we return, we're going to continue this campaign of terror against the Nazis. Thank you very much for watching, guys, and as always, till next time.